<laughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, ex welcome to Yes, ex Zeke's Awesome Indie, the home of all your hottest HD whisper throughs. Today we're today we're um, sorry, I tried my hardest. Um, today we're actually looking at doing Bye Bye Bloom, which is kill a Crimson Kuro Peko, and the Crimson Kuro Peko is, well, is in the same area as a goddamn what's it called? Uh, What's it called again? You know, that thing that I often die to when I'm live streaming for no particular reason? Because we try to fight two of them at once? Uh, not Diablos. Diablos isn't it. Devil Joe. Devil Joe. Yeah, Devil Joe is it. And you know, I'm pretty sure that we are also going to take out the Devil Joe. Or I would want to take out the Devil Joe as well. Because if we're just taking out the Crimson Crow Peko, this is a very easy quest for this current group. Um, we'll, we'll see when the Devil Joe actually shows up, which should be fairly soon, all things consider. What now? I didn't even know this was possible. Um, let me up, somebody? Somebody kick me or do something? I don't know. Ah! Yeah, I, I did not even know that was possible. Oh god, why have you done this to me? So sorry! Wow, that was, that was quite the roar. Uh, I love how such unexpected noises can come out of this asshole. I'm probably actually going to want to do a wyvern fire here while it's paralyzed. Ideally, I also do not want to hit my teammates, which it turned out perfectly, really, all things considered. Unfortunately, the bad thing about fading the Crimson Crow Peko is just the sheer amount of room that there isn't. And I know that's kind of difficult with a very positive negative there. But you know, a negative, a positive can be negative as well. Okay. He was actually staggered there in the middle of his trying to shock everybody. Definitely a good thing. And so far he hasn't summoned any monsters. Maybe the Devil Joe isn't actually around? Or maybe it's summoning the wrong monster? Uh-oh. I really thought it was going to hop back again. Hop back, hop back to where you once belonged. Kuropeko was a bird who thought he was a fighter, but it turns out he really sucked. I'm bad at coming up with new lyrics. That's why I get paid big bucks. That's why I don't get paid big bucks, I guess. More accurately. More accurately speaking, getting lots of explosive damage done here. Should probably be doing other types of damage though, but I am just getting juggled like a fucking juggalo, which is what I, where I assume the term juggalo comes from, right? Those are people who like being juggled as a fetish? Of course. Let me actually see where this thing's going. It's almost dead already. Should, uh, like, I'm... This would be the world's shortest episode. I guess I could cut some out, but there's so much editing for so little reward. And then you will get your just rewards. Let's shut up, Chafar. You're not invited to this Let's Play. Oh. But I have ultimate cosmic power. Unlimited cosmic power. <laughs> oh. Wyvern fire. Oh, that was such an awesome ending. Where, where, where am I? Should probably duck whenever I try to harvest. I always forget that. And I should also be going to um, see if I can gra gather some minerals from that cave since I'm in G rank. Might as well do some mining while I'm here. No more harvests. Let's roll. Let's roll, bitches. Battlebots roll out? No Metabots? No, Metabots don't roll out. I didn't rewatch Metabots in recent history. And by recent history, I mean like two and a half years ago. You know, it, it kind of holds up. It has some funny moments. Oh, what? I'm full on stuff? What do I have? Oh, I still have my lag here, Chris, stuff. Oh. I guess I don't get myself some extra mining goods. Mining goods are a no-go. 
Um, so maybe thank you guys for watching. If I decide this episode is way too short, I may, might append a second one on top. Uh, it's like five minutes long. Either way, though, I will see you guys shortly or next time. Bye. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, Zeke here again today to welcome you to my channel, home of the hottest HD whisper throughs. <laughs> Sorry, I, I know you guys are probably sick of the joke already, but I am not, and I am willing to take some spare rations because, well, to be honest, I don't really know. I already have smoke bombs for this fight. This is Fire and Ice, or Opposites Detract, which is a um, Glacial Agnactor and a Agnactor in general. An Agnactor general, which is like a, a political profession, clearly. Wow, these guys are really in sync. I should get fucking married or something. Who am I kidding? They probably are married. God damn it. This fight is already being such an asshole. Um, it's very, very important to keep your, your everything fairly high in this fight because... Because, 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 because it's very easy to get, like, comboed by beam attacks over and over again. Which is also a gigantic pain in the dick. Okay, I did actually manage to get that shot off on the foot in general. Oh, God. Yep, here we go. Already not doing too well in terms of... In terms of needing to eat a potion or two. But remember, though, there are life powders in the middle. There are high potions on the sides. This game, this game can be won. Now, the reason I decided to do this, I, I know several of you have seen me do it on stream before. This team that I actually have running right now is fairly incredibly strong. Despite the fact that quite ev almost everybody needs needs a life powder right now. Had to actually panic dive to get out of the way there. By the way, in this panic diving, fucking totally legit thing to do especially in order to dodge the beam attacks because there is no way to block them. So have your weapon away, be panic diving, pretty much abs, always be shielding, um, strafing, I don't know, uh-oh, uh-oh, that is not good, that is going to hit me hardcore. Okay, what I need to do here is actually run away. I will also not life powder. I don't need a life powder yet. Fortunately, that fire beam should do tons of damage to that goddamn glacial like Nactor. But I think that monsters don't quite do as much damage as we do. I think anyways, I'm not entirely sure about that in all honesty. I'm really trying to take out the glacial like Nactor before the um, regular Agnactor because he inflicts blights and blights are what I like to call colloquially a pain in the dick. Oh, I absolutely cannot do that. Um, his back is not broken, but the ice is broken off his back, so that's a good thing at least. The ice doesn't grow back, it just hardens and softens over time if it doesn't burrow. So I'm probably in trouble here. I've gotten away with this longer than I should have, all things considered. But I do have a fairly good time here. Nice exposed belly shots. Five-year-old belly shot. Um, that is a song I do not want to quote because it is inappropriate in every way. That was from a Mind the Self-Indulgence album called Alienating Our Audience where they tried to be as offensive as possible. And remember, if you're going to be doing this stuff, Approach so you get more done. Also, that was a really well-timed um, flash bomb. And I think I have all the harvested I could possibly get there. Um, I do actually want to break its tail, but like I said, this team is a bit too good. I appear to be... I appear to be... We appear to be killing monsters faster than we can break the parts on them. Which is slightly remedied by my goddamn heartbreaker. Oh god, no you don't. My heartbreaker. Have I ever mentioned heart players hate him? Learn the one secret this man uses to break all the harps. <laughs> I, I don't know what I'm talking about. But I am entertained. 
Are you not amused? What is that line from? Ow. Okay, I got hit there, but I probably did a lot of damage, especially since this is a... I forget whether it's a long or a wide shot. I think it's a long shot. But, um... Either way, that should have hit several segments of him and probably gotten quite a few of them close to breaking already. Just need to wait for him to land and then get the fuck in there. Whoa, uh, Jesus. God damn that switch axe. So I am currently in the process of trying to make myself some decent hammers to use. Because I could use hammers like a schniz. Like hammer schniz. Gry's kind of needs a healing. Oh. Uh, uh, never mind, somebody just used a life powder. Well, I just got spare life powders, so how about that? Well, looky here. I'll just use them. Oh! Man, I'm being healed all over the place. Could even say singing, we will, we will rock you. Come on, just let me, let me attack you. All I want is to attack. All I need is attacks. Bum, ba, da, da, da. Uh, remember, if I actually unload entirely on monsters, I'm more likely to break parts than if I do not. I guess at this point, I should maybe go after its beak. Although, its beak can be a bit hard to hit when it's flailing around like an asshole. Which is also the name of my first um, punk hardcore band. Flailing around like assholes. Or my first punk hardcore band's album, I guess. Sounds like a better album name. Somebody is actually doing poison damage? Grise! No! What have you done? Little Grise, what have you done? Little Grise, what have you done? And I say, oh fuck, you'd better not die again, you asshole. <laughs> again, if any of the people actually playing with me right now feel like, um, are actually watching this, I do not mean any of the asshole stuff that I keep saying. So please ignore it. Ignore. Ignore. Igneous. Lovely. So I do indeed get myself some Scorching Pluras. It's a magical Leopluridon. I'll get rid of my mini whetstones here. Not sure why I picked up some of these um, items. Fortunately, I'm just getting a lot of Scorching Pluras. I think I needed Scorching Pluras for something. Agnactor Peel. Swap that out for my rations. Indeed. And I'm done. All right. All right. I've been actually wanting the Glacial Agnactor set for quite a while, so I'm very happy about that. There we go. <laughs> oh, I do appreciate doing that. They go flying so far. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you guys next time. I think this will be appended to the previous episode, as it was rather short the last episode. <laughs> Later.